Hey there folks, um, good morning. It is 4.54 a.m. on Halloween, October 31st, 2011. And I'm sitting here in the bathroom and um, one of the things that I wanted to show you or present to you was this kind of, you know, working on kind of a new idea um, where we recently discovered Stumble Upon thanks to Brandon Langless who showed it to me and um, after um, setting up my intro um, and what I want to do with it is um, work my way up to having you know my own digital goes um, and by that I mean um, that I will every day look at and favorite different things that are on Stumble, and um, I think what I might do is try to do like a top 10, although for the meantime, yeah, one of the things that I wish I, I could figure out how to do with Stumble, I'm not sure if it will actually let me, but one of the things that I want to figure out if I can do is when I look at my um, favorites page, um, have it set so that the top 10 on my favorites page are the top 10 most viewed out of the things that I liked, not the top 10 most recent. Because, um, you know, I'd rather have a range of topics that I can talk to you about, um, that, and make videos about, and subjects and all that sort of stuff, that is more based on, yes, I'm interested in it, but not so much based on whether or not I recently discovered it, but based on whether or not in recent um, times it, is it popular. Does it have more views? Like, the number one, like, uh, out of my top ten list, those should be the top ten things that have the most views, um, and so on. Um, so that every time I come to it, I can even say yes. Something we reported on last week is still getting really good reviews. Or, hey, we got a newcomer to the top ten list, kind of thing. But in the meantime, really all it comes down to is that um, I have to kind of collate the information myself and um, do the top ten list um, myself, kind of like saying, hey, Here's this week's top ten from Stumble Upon, you know, and the, this week's top ten from Stumble Upon is a combination of the things that I like and the things that apparently millions of other people like, and because it's in my top ten and this is a weekly thing, or do I have to do it daily? I don't know. So, yeah. Um. Anyway, um, we're gonna try and do this kind of um from the hip. So, um, that's why we have um, screeny up so that we're recording what's going on on my screen. We have the webcam up so that you can see my reaction, such as it is, you know, um, to what's going on, um, to what I'm seeing on the screen. Um, and while all this is going on, I'm actually playing Eve. Um, what I do when I do this sort of thing is some menial tasks that I don't have to think a lot about. And one of those things that's going on is if you notice um, over here, I'm going somewhere. And that journey is going to take um, 16 more jumps. And that means, you know, a long time in the EVE world. So I have a fairly long amount of time 
in which I can, um, you know, get some background. stuff done. But I'm only going to record for like 10 minutes at a time to give myself, you know, and we're already at seven minutes, so um, what you're about to see is me trying to assemble my first stumble upon story um, so that you can, you know, see it. And what is this one? From speedhunters.com. Load, you bastard. Load. thing is, is, I need to figure out how to remove it from my favor. Then every day I would be adding more, I would be adding more, you know, options to the list. And then every day reporting on, hey, what's today's top 10? Um, but if I can't remove it from the, you know, top, from the listing at all, then it's always bees there and it's always, you know, confuses me. So I don't know what to do. So, um, not your regular BMW M3, um, here is some pictures of, um, there we go, um, from speedhunters.com and Dino Del Carbonair, um, they're looking at a, I don't know what year it is, an E36. M BMW M3, um, and what I figured I would do is, um, you know, take some pictures and show them to you. Um, this is work on the cars being done at City Performance Center in Sydney, Australia. And what I figured I'd do from this point on is is play some background music according to these awesome pictures that are obviously coming from speedhunters.com because it's down there at the bottom right of every picture like right there these are some pretty cool shots and I thought I'd I'm sure somebody out there would like to take a look at them and maybe go back to speedhunters and check out um, what they what they got going on but for me this is just some really cool pictures that I will add to um, we're getting shot at. No, we're just on our way to the. Um, uh, yep, we're jumping. There we go. Boom, jumped, and we are at ten.